I forgot my hat. But anyways, good morning, everyone. How are you doing on this beautiful Ohio day? I'll tell you what. For an early morning mow, this is the perfect place to come to. Especially when it's high 80s, gonna be 90 degree day. This place is almost fully shaded. And I'll tell you what, just coming from in the sun to in here, probably 20, 25 degree difference. I mean, no joke, it is comfortable in here. It's not humid at all. remember a couple months ago Lathan got off and was actually walking this so I showed him how to adjust his weight on the mower so that he was able to mow all this he's getting a lot better uh, the biggest thing we're working on with him now is not hooking at the end so when you lay your stripe I wish I had an example here to show you but when you lay your stripe and you go to turn into your Y turn some people turn too soon and it leaves what we call a hook at the end okay these are what professional landscapers lawn care guys like and gals will mess with one another so if you ever see somebody stripes and they got those hooks at the end you mess with them and just bust their child's and be like man look at those hooks you know but with that being said you just don't want to turn too soon and what you can do as well if you are turning too soon you can go back around and do a perimeter cut once you're done even if you have to do two perimeter passes and knock those hooks out so they're at least not noticeable so just a quick tip there for you guys. This stuff is still growing like crazy. a three and a half inch cut as well guys so he's probably knocking i bet he's probably knocking six to eight inches off of that thing he's getting it TQ's up there. Just finishing up some trimming here. Lathan's way back there, he's about done. TQ's finishing up as close as she could get to the pond area here. Just got a few more trees. We'll be on out of here. Stuck. Are you stuck? Bro, that tree's moving. You better watch. What do you got going on here, bro? I really got stuck here. Here, let me see if I can give you some extra. How did you even do that? Go 
go that way. Easy. Easy, killer. Easy, killer. Jeez, Elise. I'm in the tree business. Uh, you were in the mud business for a second. You went from mud into logging in two seconds. I'm an all-service uh, business here. We got to be careful around these things. Look at all the ants. Uh, yeah, it's rotten. Woo! Oh yeah, it's it's completely rotten. Well, should we just do it to the rest? No. <laughs> I don't think they're all gonna fall like that, but who knows? We definitely gotta be careful in here. These pines are all dead. I don't even know how in the world she did that. <laughs> oh dear heaven, I gotta get back to trimming. Think fast. Ah! That wasn't ready. Sun's out, gun's out.
right, just a little more clean up here and we're good. Don't you drive across my strikes. Quick tip right there guys, if you notice she stayed on the grass as long as possible, make your distance between the property and the trailer as short as possible in case you got to do some cleanup. Feel good? Get it, got it good. Good. What? Nothing, Lathan. I'm not watching you because last time we were at this property, well, I know, I know. not last time, two weeks ago, lost his headset and eye, eye protection. We hold on to things a little longer around Spencer Lawn Care. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just playing, we're just busting his chops. That was actually TQ's idea. What did I do? She told me to go watch Lake and make sure he didn't leave his ear and eye protection on the uh watch it disappear. Right. <sighs> Y'all drinking water? Yep. By you back there. Yeah. How many bottles you had today? It's like six. Six so far? Yeah, and that's normally what I drink in the day. Alright. I'm done. I'm trying to get Lathan on the gallon jug thing. He doesn't want to get on it, so. We, uh, I'll typically go through a gallon and a half. When it gets real hot, a couple gallon. I like to at least get a gallon in a day, so. Yes. Do you wanna follow that up with anything else, TQ? Yep. That's it. <laughs> Let's go. All right, so with the amount of rain we've had, I don't know if you can make it out. There's a lot of standing water over there and it just follows along the ditch line. So I'm not going to be going across it. I'm just gonna have to go back and forth around it, get it as best as I can without getting stuck. So let's do it. going they are moving a lot of stuff at this business a lot more activity than normal so I'm gonna try my hardest to stay out of their way Lathan is on the outside of the fence mowing he did a really good job um, from the things that I did notice that he mowed already he's just uh, finishing up the bigger part back there or up there
Time to fill up these dirty babies. That sun is bright. Okay. come behind you because the glare is awful. So if what we get a job to have a job. Trying to talk here. So it's what we have left on the two cycle. Oh my gosh, so many interruptions. Be quiet please. <laughs> uh, so with what we have left here in the two cycle we're going to top off the equipment and then refill Yeah, no, don't forget the caps, please. Yeah, yeah Lathan has it. The good stuff. Those are the sound effects now. Since we can't 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 use any. Okay, Lathan's putting the cap on that one. Good job. Great job. Yes, sir. <laughs> one mower, 40 bucks almost, guys. One mower. Oh, God. Come on, Lathan. That, one's, that one was almost empty, so that one's going to probably take a little more. Entertainment at the gas station today. Like I told TQ, I'm going to have to get a job just to have a job. Yeah? What what other job would you do just to have this job? I'm about to start Uber delivering. Hey, that's a... No. Why? That's more gas you have to... to that's true. Do. And I don't have very economically uh, feasible vehicles. Yeah, either. I don't think the trucks will, or the, even the Tahoe. What you thinking about selling the Tahoe? Yeah, we'll see. Getting a little... Um, Ford Focus or something. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Get 40 miles a gallon. There you go. 40 miles a gallon. She she went from a Ford Escape to the Tahoe because it was too small, and now the Tahoe is too small. Yeah. Where do you go from here? Minivan. Minivan. That's true. Suburban. <laughs> oh, it's gonna max my card out without even filling up. We haven't even got to the five gallon yet. Yeah, I might have to do a separate transaction on that one. Yeah, there it do. goes. I'm going to go back in there, Lee, and just put it in there real quick. So, $5.09 a gallon, 510, you might as well say. That was only 15 and a half gallons, which typically we hold 21 for both mowers. Hold that for me, Lee, please. Pick your poison, pick your poison. Going back in twice. I think that one actually almost filled up, so. There's 
one gallon. Yeah, there we go. A gallon and a half. Lathan's made more money than okay. us right now. Okay, okay, okay. You're gonna overflow. No, you gotta okay. get, you gotta get max. every last drop. Max. You never know. Tomorrow might be thirteen dollars a gallon. <laughs> you want to fill this up too, just in case? Okay, you never know. Cap on. Good to go. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video i'm tired as always keep mowing keep growing keep making money boys we'll talk to you later teach you out peace bye